About three and a half million drivers used the PA Turnpike over the Thanksgiving weekend. Plans are now underway that are going to change how the Turnpike looks a few years from now. KDK Harrisburg Bureau Chief Seth Kaplan tells us about new exits and a new way of collecting tolls. It's a sign of the times. The 88-year-old PA Turnpike is about to get upgraded. Even though we don't uh, collect cash anymore, we still have cars slowing down at our toll plaza. Soon tolls will be a holdup. The toll booth will largely be demolished. New plans called for what's known as open road tolling. In 2024, it's coming in the eastern part of the state that those tolls will be collected by high-speed gantry. And then it's coming to Pittsburgh in 2026. Here's what it'll look like, collecting tolls at 70 miles an hour. It's already in action along the Atlantic City Expressway. The new interchanges are cheaper to build and smaller. In Pennsylvania, three new ones are coming. It's a Lafayette Street interchange in Montgomery County, Scranton Beltway in Lackawanna County, and Route 130 interchange in Westmoreland County. So again, the east first, the west second, which, come to think of it, is kind of the opposite of another big turnpike technology initiative, which is already up and running. The microgrid. In Westmoreland County, powering a turnpike workshop. The shoulders along the turnpike might also get a makeover like this one. An environmentally friendly version of our lawn, right? So there are wildflowers and other pollinators on there. In Middletown, Dolphin County, Seth Kaplan, KDKA News.